Shortly after the 2023 Honda Civic Type R made its debut, we had lots of questions. Is it going to be as great as before? Is the added power going to affect how it handles? Will it live up to our expectations? After spending a few days with the new Honda Civic Type R for our Car of the Year program, we're happy to report it continues to be among the best sporty cars available today. A quick glance at the judge's notes proves it. Guest Judge Chris Theodore, I would recommend it to anyone. Detroit editor Alyssa Priddle, it likes to turn and burn. Director of Editorial Operations Mike Floyd, wow, wow, wow. This is such a blast to drive. The comments go on and on. Let's start with the basics. Using the updated Civic platform, the Type R adds a lot of hardware to make it special. Besides the 2.0-liter turbocharged inline-four engine that makes 315 horsepower and 310 pounds-foot of torque, the Type R gains an active exhaust valve for a sonorous sound, an improved cooling system, a mechanical limited slip differential, rev matching, and a stiffer body augmented by a retuned suspension and steering rack. But even with all these upgrades, making the Type R better than before was going to be a difficult task, and judges had mixed opinions about whether the new generation car was definitively better than the prior models. It has Porsche tier steering, brake, throttle, and shift feel, which puts the driver in a zen mentality, no matter if they're driving fast or slow, associate editor Billy Rebach said. But despite consensus that the 2023 Type R is an enthusiast's dream, Priddle questioned whether Honda toned down the new model a smidge too much. The previous generation was so incredibly fantastic, and I'm not sure this one measures up, she said. Is my memory tinged by romanticism? Everyone who buys a Type R will do so, primarily because of its performance, but its practicality also remains noteworthy. A Civic Type R is a Civic before it's a Type R, buyer's guide director Zach Gale said. That means a spacious backseat, a relatively capacious cargo area, and a high-quality interior. The 2023 model is wider, longer, and lower than before, and although it gained more weight as a result, it also added more comfort and amenities. The cabin is loaded with superb materials and technology, from the digital instrument cluster with its Formula One-inspired shift indicator to a premium audio system. All that good stuff comes at a cost, and as a result its starting price is much higher than the outgoing model. That said, there's only one trim available, and it comes fully loaded. The Civic's cabin is simply so good, it even feels appropriate in the mid-40,000 range, Deputy Editor Alexander Staklosa said. Honda's hot hatch won the judges' emotions, but we must consider it against our of the year criteria, not our hearts. In those areas, the Type R scored very well, so it was easy to select it as a finalist. At minimum, as Theodore opined, the new Honda Civic Type R is the best hot hatch on the US market. That's one hell of an accolade in and of itself.